Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be another Timu haul. Um, I have more headed my way. Um, I will put up in the eye in the sky my previous Timu haul that had a lot of solar items, um, things that you can take on camping trips, and things that um, are going to help you when there are no plugs. So alternatives that are really nice to have. So let's go ahead and get into this. All right, the first two things I'm gonna share are these right here. Um, these are for the kitchen and they're aprons. I do enjoy a good apron and I thought these looked charming. These are one size fits all but I am plus size, so I may have to extend the straps in the back. I don't know. Okay. So this, all these will be linked down at the bottom of the page for you to see and see what their current pricing is. Plus there's a 30% off discount that you can use. This is not a sponsored video. I paid for all this out of my own pocket. Okay. So this is the first one. This is really pretty blue apron. And it's the kind that you throw over your shoulder. In the back. You see that? Let's, let's do it like this. There you go. And it has this nice big pocket here in the front. Then this is the back. So I got it in this pretty blue color with the floral. And then this is the back. So you literally put this over your head, then you tie it. But technically you don't need to tie it because it goes right over your head and it's gonna you know, hold tight right there. So I got this really pretty blue one, same exact design, but in the pink. And then they had a green color as well. And this is a nice big, almost like a kangaroo pocket. They consider this so you could tuck things away while you're cleaning or moving about or even hold your cell phone or your rags or whatever you might be doing. So I got these. I thought these were so charming. Okay, then for my dollhouse miniatures, this is going to be a mix of items. They had these on sale. And they came just like this, um, but they were on sale at a great price. And if you can see that beautiful design, see if you can see that beautiful design. And I believe this is a 15 piece and it is a perfect 112 scale. And I also picked these up and I believe these are the same design because they were all $3 and some change when I picked them up on sale again 15 piece it's going to look beautiful in my houses and I own several 112 scale houses so that was a really good buy for, um, for getting 15 pieces then I got this set of um, paint brushes and I can't remember how many are in here. Yeah, it's not saying. Oh, 30 pieces. Okay, so they had it in pink and they had it like in blue. And I got a 30 piece set in pink. And I think when I purchased it, it may have been $2.99. So I, I picked those up. Then I got this one. And it has like this kind of effect. And I know I got a couple of different kinds for this. Let me see if I can pull them out very quickly. Mm, maybe I only got two. Yeah, I may have only gotten two. Let me see. Yeah, I only got two of that kind. So this is the two different designs. They're completely different as you can see. But I thought I might be able to use these not only in my junk journaling and my regular journaling, but my dollhouse miniatures for windows and when I create scenes and room boxes and things like that and you're creating windows. So let's take a peek. So it comes in this really pretty one. And then you open them up and they're like gorgeous. Look at that. They're beautiful. And there's different kind. Okay. Hope you guys can see those well. They're very pretty. 
So they're absolutely gorgeous. I love the way these look. Let me put these back in here so I don't lose them because they're very thin. Um, they can just disappear in a blink when they're thin like that and slippery. So that's one set. And then that's what the second set looks like, okay? But we're gonna pop her open so you have a better look. And again, all the links will be down at the bottom. And I purchased all these myself. And that's the way this one looks. Okay. Very beautiful. And they have all these different kinds. So there you go. And I love this. That's beautiful within itself. That's going to be a nice little thing to play with for decorating. And um, it was funny. I was trying to clear off my, my desk here so I could do this video. And I came across a pack of Prima ATC cards. And um, I had somebody ask me if they wanted to trade ATC cards. <laughs> and I was like, oh, I can do it now. And then this one um, reminds me a little bit of um, Prima. And I thought that this was really pretty. Lacy poem letters. And that's how they look. And they're small. Cute for um, tucking away inside the little envelopes that you might be making. Or putting a picture in there. As you could tell, it has different themes. This one's going to be great for dollhouse miniatures. Look at that. I didn't even buy this for that purpose, but look at that. I could just cut those out. That's exciting. Oh, and look at that. I can use that for miniatures as well and just cut those out. I love it when you get a twofer. Very pretty. Oh, look at that. I can do that too. And this letter. I can use that in there too. Oh, this is charming. And I love the weathered look that it has. Very nice. I like it. No muss, no fuss, and it's a lot of the work's already done for you, so you could just create all those fun things. Um, the next one is this one, and I think I only got one because I wasn't too sure. Let me see, did I only get one, or maybe the other one hasn't come in yet? I still have more headed my way, but um, these are gorgeous. Look at that. Let's pop these open. It, I bought this with the same um, purpose of using them for my hobby. And look at that. These are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So pretty. Well, these are going to be fabulous. Oh, yeah. Those are going to be perfect. Okay, perfect. Oh, that's going to be fun to use and to try to create. I'm, I'm trying to put them back in there nicely, but something is holding it back from going all the way in. I wonder what it is. Is it one of the edges? Let me make sure it goes all the way in. Okay. Yeah, it's always fun to see what you can find on Timu. You never know what you're going to find. Um, the rabbit hole, it'll take you down to all kinds of really cool products for home, for crafting, um, just for all kinds of things. Then this one right here, and this one has like mushrooms. And let's take a peek at this one. It's like a, a very long look to it. Okay, so it opens up from the back, it looks like, back here. Then it looks like that. So, it's just different mushrooms. And then they come out just like that one. That's very cute. That I can use that in my junk journal. And I think I'll be able to. Then, um, I picked up some of this deco paper here. And they had different kinds, and this is this is the one that looks like it's um, burnt. And I do mix media, 
so this is the look that I like. <laughs> this is this is the look that I like. I don't think I can open it up from the bottom. Nope. Gotta do it from the top. Okay, let me show you what these look like so you have an idea. But they did have different kinds to choose from. And not all of them look like this. This is just the one that I wanted because it, it looked already like it was aged. And it was going to be really cool to use. Okay. So that's what that looks like. Very cool. Then I did get um, this little sewing kit. I bought another one. And um, my kiddos were looking at it. And all the little things fell out. But it's a sewing kit for dollhouse miniatures. Hope y'all can see it. And you open it up and it has everything inside. Okay, and it's all loose. And it's made like out of metal. Okay, and it's really cool looking. So let me put this in this room right here. I don't want to lose that. Ooh, and as I say that, I'm dropping a piece from my dollhouse. <laughs> of course. Then, um, let's just do something dollhouse miniatures. I hope this is okay. This came, look how squashed up that came. Because all this was inside of a bag. It came in a bag and I'm like, oh man, I hope it's not broken. I hope not. Because I really like these. So this is like a repurchase for me. I hope it didn't break. Oh, thank goodness it did not break. So again, this is a repurchase and it's a vase with the resin and the flowers. Let me show you the other one. Let me just do this. Make it a little faster for me here. Okay. And I think this one should be purple. This one should be purple. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it even has a little purple dot there. So it should be a purple one. Okay. Hope it's in one piece. Yes, it is. So there's the purple one. Hope you guys can see it. Oh, there we go. And then here's the yellow. It's very pretty. Okay. Then um, this is a repeat per a repeat purchase. Um, the clock went on sale, and these clocks are amazing. I mean, amazing for the price, and it dropped down really low because the prices go up and down on Timu. And I told myself, girl, if that goes on sale again, you better get another one. And I sure did. So she looks like that. Okay. And look at the little horse there on the top and all that detail. And the inside moves. So that's what I got as well. Because it was on sale. Then I do have some papers here, paper stacks that I purchased that I'll be sharing with you in a moment. Mm, I got two clocks. Yay! I know, I thought I had bought two. I was like, I, I think I was supposed to have two. And I did. Okay, I got two. Perfect. Because it was on sale. Then in this one, what do we have? Oh, this is new. Okay, this is like a statue, a lady statue. And I thought it was really interesting. And I immediately thought about my dining room in my um, Fox Hall Manor. And that's what she looks like. Okay. That's really pretty. Very pretty. I only got one because I didn't know if it was going to work or not. I didn't know if it was going to be too big. So actually, it's a very good size. And I should buy a couple more if they're on sale. And then I got these, of course. Some very nice utensils that are decorative. Okay. Then I did pick up this light. And look, it's already poking through the box. 
because they had this for like 40 cents or 50 cents or something really cheap um, and I bought it for the house for the for the hallway and that's what the box looks like then I got these um, these I'm without words laces that you don't need to tie and they like screw together uh, my mother is elderly she's about to have um, heart surgery and she has Alzheimer's and she does still wear shoes with laces and I wanted to get her something that she didn't have to lace and they had these and I want to put these on a pair of her shoes and see if she likes them so I'm gonna keep that in that container okay I don't know what's in this so let's see what's in this I don't know because I don't remember let's see what it might be let's see let's see all right there we go and there we go so oh okay this is blocking so this is a container of blocking this is um to make florals that you can use for trains um, scenery and dollhouse miniatures and I got that mix that looks like an autumn mix and I love the fact that it came in this container I know I ordered some more flocking um, but I think they're coming like in little baggies but I prefer the whole container situation that's just so much easier to manage when you're dealing with flocking now um, I did buy this larger silicone mat but I also got another big mat coming my way that can hold paint and hold water. And when I'm painting, um, that's on its way. But I bought this one to use when I'm not painting and I'm doing hot gluing and things like that. Just so it could be on a bigger scale. And it is, I'm trying to pop it open here, it's kind of folded. Here we go. I think I got the edge. Here we go. Here we go. So she looks like this. And it's like this big. So it's that big. Okay. And there's the silicone part. So nothing will stick to it. Um, it's nice and big as you can tell. So it's a nice big one. So I'm looking forward to laying, this, laying that down for me to use. Then I do have um this this is age of steam so this is going when i this this came up when i put in the word steampunk because that's part of mixed media and this popped up and i saw it a few times i didn't get it um i've been placing orders for a pretty long time now and i finally pressed the button for this beautiful one that says age of steam so it comes like that okay look at that and then it has the, the vellum piece for it so you have your regular and then your vellum your regular sheet then a vellum that is beautiful wow really pretty look at her and the vellum Wow, look at that one. And let me look at the vellum. That is gorgeous. Oh, these are so much fun. They're just so unique and different. And look at the vellum for that one. And look at that. With the houses. Oh, oh my goodness. This is like a home run. Wow. I wish I would have bought this a lot sooner. Oh, man. This one is like a beauty. A straight up beauty. Okay. Then I got this one. That's called Serenity. And it is a 6x6. Six six. And you get, let's see, how many pages? Hmm. 
This 160 GSM cardstock. 12 different designs times 2. So 24, but both of them are the same. And let's take a peek so you can see what you would get if you get this one. This called Serenity with the Owls and with the Mushrooms. So, and they're not double sided, just, just, you know, so you have a heads up. So it looks like. Very nice. Oh, that's a beautiful, majestic looking owl. Oh, look at that. Oh, that would be fun to use. Yeah, these are great. And I love it when they when they put nature in it. And I love mushrooms. Things with mushrooms. I don't eat mushrooms, but I love them on stickers and on paper. <laughs> I don't eat them. But I like my stickers and paper. And then that's the last set. That is a beautiful set. Okay, it's called Serenity and it's on my link. And uh, yeah, that one's gorgeous. Then we have one more set that looks almost like in a signature form. If you know about signatures, it looks like it's already set up like a signature. And. The Mysterious Manual. Okay, so let's take a peek at this one. Hmm, this one's very interesting indeed. Okay, so it looks like you get two of each. And it is not double-sided, but all you do is bend the page. So that's, that looks like signatures for inside of a book if you create this size book or even a larger book and you have these signatures in there look at that I know I ordered some other ones that have this style of signature that all you have to do is bend it and maybe just do the edges see the edges are already done on here all you gotta do is bend it and stick it in your book to give it more character look how beautiful that is oh. Ooh, that is pretty. Wow. Oh, wow. That is magical looking. Look at that stag. Wow. I have a stag here. Um, I have a ball that stands on this really pretty glass, and there's a stag. Do you guys see it? It's a stag, like walking through the snow. I don't know if you guys can see it or not, but I'm trying to show it to you. <laughs> wow. It reminds me of that. Oh, that just took my breath away. My goodness. Here we go. So there's all these really cool um, sheets that are already pre-made for you. I'm trying to tell you. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That is gorgeous. Oh, you could do so many things. Oh, and look at her. Oh, that's pretty. And look, another stag. So very majestic looking. Magical. And it's walking across. Going over a bridge held up by anything. By nothing, I should say. Wow. Oh, man, this was... That was gorgeous. Again, this should be listed in my links. Um, so if you're interested in buying this, and I believe they had different kinds. I only bought one, this particular style. And you should be able to find it. This is the coolest thing ever. I'm so happy. I love this. I love everything that I got. Wow. Okay, well, thank you everybody for coming by. I hope you enjoyed this haul, and I will see you guys again because I still have more packages headed my way. Check out my link, and if it's your first time shopping, make sure that you get everything that you want and use that 30% off discount listed below. First pinned comment and in the description box. Okay, bye.